Well, new information tonight. Business owners and citizens in Fairhope are speaking out against government overreach in a new zoning proposal. At the heart of the debate, the Greeno Road Overlay District. NBC 15's James Gordon joins us now. Well, James, the key issue is controlling what businesses do on Highway 98 South. Well, you know, the goal is to preserve the look and feel of Fairhope along this busy stretch of highway. Now, business owners say that's all fine, but they don't want the city's reach to get out of hand. It's a concept that dates back to the late 1980s, requiring commercial businesses in a six-mile stretch of Greeno Road to follow a set of restrictions above and beyond current zoning requirements. I'm skeptical about it, and I'd, I'd like to see some... I'd like to see private businesses left alone. Right. Today, people were signing a petition at the Old Time Feed Store, a petition asking city zoning officials and the city council to reconsider business restrictions, like no outside sales, no drive throughs no single-use buildings, over 8,000 square feet, and no parking in front of buildings. There's so many pieces and parts in the document that we've seen that, that they're, just, they're just not just overreach in my opinion. Cecil Christenberry is the owner of the old time feed store. His business would be grandfathered in, but. Well, not to be selfish, and I'm sorry for us, but somebody else may want a garden center along Greeno Road. It wouldn't be fair, in my opinion, to them for them not to be able to have outdoor sales, whether it's cars, plants, whatever it might be. The Fairhope City Council would have the final say. Well, I don't think it is Airport Boulevard. Yes, it's gotten more crowded there's more traffic but that just comes with growth. Council member Robert Brown says hearing from anyone who is concerned is important. After all this is now the public input stage. It was a bad rollout you know there was not a lot of input from those people along Greeno Road. Misinformation has been put out and a lot of the stuff that's being discussed in this uh, overlay district are already existing ordinances that are being enforced now. Now, there have been several presentations, but no public hearings on the issue. Right now, planning and zoning has hit the pause button on all of this. Now, city officials say they want to hear from citizens, and perhaps this new petition drive is the first step. In Fairhope, James Gordon, NBC 15 News.